Tonight on Special Assignment, the TSA. Lots of folks complain about them, but wait till you see all the stuff they've taken away from passengers at the Tucson airport. Sure, we hate taking off our shoes, leaving behind our water bottles. Those blades, all the hassles of the TSA line. But tonight, Marcelino Benito gets a rare look at just what Tucson passengers are trying to get on board. Marcelino? That's right, Jennifer, and we aren't talking about nail clippers here. We're talking everything from the strange to the downright dangerous. <laughs> the TSA. Sir. I'll get it together. I promise. The butt of our jokes. <laughs> Some folks annoyed. She went up my leg, up both legs, from behind. With a little too much touching. And then turn around and did it in the front. Others not happy when they lose their stuff. I just got my favorite belt of all time confiscated. But then he admits. It's a white belt and it has like little fake, like really fake looking little plastic bullets. And a bullet ridden belt is just the beginning. But they look really fake. With all these passengers coming, going round the clock at TIA and Sky Harbor, the TSA has its hands full. We see everything. All the stuff you try to get up there actually confiscated, never makes it off the ground, instead sent right here to Phoenix. And here's the official pile at the state's surplus property department. Bins full of pocket knives. Every toy gun you can think of. Handy workout equipment. But weights, of course, could be used as a weapon. So can rolling pins, sledgehammers, rocks, bombshell casings, even brass knuckles. All of this stuff came off Arizona passengers. You, you kind of look at stuff and, you know, the magic eight ball and, you know, whip or something like that. You kind of go, okay. Across the nation, the TSA takes away more than 750,000 items from us every year. Still, for some travelers, the searches, the pat downs seem like a waste of time. I'm crying because I'm just really, really upset that as an American, I have to go through this. But look what else your fellow passengers try to get on board in Arizona. Yes, that's a machete. A machete. And then there are all the knives, big and small, hidden in belts. What do you think people are thinking when they try to get this onto a plane? That's a very good question. <laughs> Some of those are clearly weapons and yeah, I don't know what people are thinking when they carry that. TSA puts out a long list of no-go items. But still, here's a slingshot. No go. A fun little cake cutter. No go. This antique iron? Nope. But there's one particular item TSA agents have to take away over and over again in Arizona. Not rocks, not sledgehammers, not those bejeweled brass knuckles. The pile here in Phoenix, packed with snow globes. Lots and lots of snow globes. Do you get the logic behind that? I don't. No, I don't. It's kind of a souvenir. But this Arizona snowman is not leaving Arizona. At least not by plane. It's right there on the no-go list. They collect snow globes. Yeah, but, oh. stupid. Maybe, but snow globes have liquid inside, and that liquid can be used to take down your plane. So they pile up here at the surplus office, waiting for folks to buy them at auction. We will allow folks to, to buy them. Hopefully not take them back on an airplane. So keep your snow globes and, yes, keep your machetes at home. And Jennifer, snow globes are actually the most popular item that's so collected across the country. So if you're taking a trip anytime soon and you want to bring me a snow globe, put it in your checked luggage. <laughs> I guess so, or <laughs> ship it to you, right? Yeah. A note to self. Okay. Meanwhile, I kind of had my eye on that rolling pin. Maybe I can get that at auction. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, all of this stuff is sold at auction at pretty cheap prices for a lot of people. Did you um? Did you see any of my lotion while you were there? I did not. Man. Did not. Maybe it's someone already bought it. So much yeah. of that stuff confiscated. <laughs> <laughs> Marcelino, appreciate it. Interesting look inside there. Yeah, definitely.